Here is how to convert your fuel car to run on natural gas and also how to convert back in case you are in an area where there is no CNG. That's compressed natural gas. Do you know you can convert your car from a fuel car to CNG and vice versa anytime? Did you know CNG is 100 naira per kilogram and it lasts longer than one liter of fuel, which the price is increasing every day? Convert your fuel car to gas to save fuel cost. Do it yourself. The price of fuel is increasing every day with fuel prices over 600 naira per litre, while compressed natural gas is 100 naira per kilogram. This had brought to the fore the need for alternative mobility that is less dependent on petrol. Already, many countries are phasing out fossil fuel vehicles to be replaced with clean energy vehicles like electric vehicles or those powered by liquefied natural gas or compressed natural gas. While vehicle electrification drive is still in its infancy, the gas option is a veritable alternative to the sudden rise in the price of petrol, which is giving many motorists a headache, introducing a game-changing solution that not only helps the environment, but also saves you money. Welcome to The Power of Conversion, transitioning your fuel car to CNG. Before diving into the conversion process, let's quickly explore the benefits of switching to compressed natural gas. One, it's environmentally friendly. CNG produces fewer greenhouse gas emissions compared to petrol, making it a cleaner and more sustainable option to its cost effective. CNG is typically cheaper than petrol, leading to significant savings on fuel costs. Three, it results in reduced engine wear. CNG burns cleaner than petrol, resulting in reduced engine wear and tear and ultimately extending the life of your car. Now let's walk through the simple conversion process. The process of converting a petrol car to run on CNG involves installing a CNG conversion kit, which includes a CNG storage cylinder, a pressure regulator and other necessary components. This has gotten in the market and the price ranges from 100,000 to 300,000 Naira depending on the cylinder size and vehicle type. When it comes to choosing a CNG conversion kit, consider the following factors. One, compatibility. Make sure the kit is compatible with your car's make and model. Consult with the kit manufacturer for guidance. Two, quality. Choose a high quality CNG conversion kit from a reputable manufacturer. This will ensure that the components are durable and perform optimally. Three, type of kit. There are two main types of CNG conversion kits, Venturi and sequential injection. Venturi kits are generally cheaper and easier to install, while sequential injection kits offer better performance and efficiency. Consult with the manufacturer to determine which type is best suited for your car. 4. Storage capacity. Consider the storage capacity of the CNG cylinder included in the kit. A larger capacity cylinder will allow you to travel longer distances between refueling, but it will also take up more space in your car. Once you have selected a suitable CNG conversion kit, purchase it from a reputable dealer or directly from the manufacturer. Step 2. Preparing your car for the conversion. Before the installation process begins, you need to prepare your car for the conversion process. First, empty the fuel tank. Drain the petrol from your car's fuel tank as it will be replaced with CNG. Next, clean the engine. Have your engine thoroughly cleaned as this will help ensure optimal performance of the CNG system. Lastly, make space for the CNG cylinder. Identify a suitable location in your car for the CNG cylinder. This will typically be in the trunk or under the car, depending on the size and shape of the cylinder. You may need to remove or modify some parts of your car to make space for the cylinder. Moving on to step three, installing the CNG conversion kit. With your car prepared, it's time to install the CNG conversion kit. The installation process typically involves the following steps. First, securely mount the CNG cylinder in the designated location, ensuring that it is properly fastened and does not interfere with any other components. Next, install the pressure regulator, which reduces the high pressure of the CNG coming from the cylinder to a suitable level for the engine. Mount the regulator in the engine compartment, following the manufacturer's guidelines. Then, run CNG fuel lines from the cylinder to the pressure regulator and then to the engine. Make sure the lines are securely fastened and free from leaks. Depending on the type of conversion kit, you may need to install CNG-specific injectors. 
Follow the manufacturer's instructions for proper installation. Install the CNG control unit, which manages the CNG system and ensures that the engine receives the appropriate amount of CNG. Mount the control unit in a suitable location, such as under the dashboard, and connect it to the engine control module and the CNG injectors. Install the CNG filler valve, used to refuel your car with CNG. Mount the valve in a convenient and accessible location, such as near the petrol filler cap, and connect it to the CNG cylinder using a high-pressure hose. Finally, install the CNG level gauge, which indicates the amount of CNG remaining in the cylinder. Mount the gauge on the dashboard and connect it to the CNG cylinder. Now let's move on to testing and fine-tuning. Test and fine-tune, then start driving your new gas vehicle. You can switch between fuel and CNG anytime in the absence of CNG if you travel to a location where there is no CNG station around, for example, an interior village. You can switch to fuel till you return to an urban area. So, are you ready to make a positive change? Take the first step towards a more sustainable future by converting your fuel car to CNG. Embrace the power of conversion, save money and drive towards a cleaner and greener tomorrow. Subscribe to this channel, like, share and let's meet in the comment section for more details.